And hello there guys and girls, this is the Prosperous back with another StarCraft 2 Harvest Swarm replay cast. It's going to be 1v1 on the Belcher Vestige. Playing a Zerg this time, yep, I'm a Zerg and my opponent is the Protoss. Lich from Team TMS. Or Lich, I don't know how to call it. Anyway. Obviously, just... Sending my overlord out to see if he's gonna get a base over here. He's just gonna get a usual pylon that you get at uh, nine, and then, then he's just gonna go for a probe anytime soon. Yep. As for me, I'm just uh, most carefully sending my overlord through. Well, not really carefully, because there's nothing to be worried about at this moment. I don't know what I'm saying. Just started after recording for a while, other stuff and playing. Anyway. I'm obviously gonna go for 15 pool, 16 hatch, I believe, since this is a Zerg versus Protoss. And... He's just gonna go for a gateway expand, actually. Let's see. So yeah, I have this Overlord over here. The second Overlord that you get, if you're playing against Terran or Protoss, you send your second Overlord where you're gonna take your expansion. Why do you do that? Because there could be a bunker here, could be bunker here, could be bunker here, or there could be pylons or photon cannons over here, and that is why you send your Overlord over here to scout for that. Now I may be wrong, but I may, I may be right. Who knows? He's not actually microing his probe as he should. He's just letting me take too many hits, I believe. And I'm gonna get another hit off. Gonna micro my drone a little bit. Getting another hit off. Another hit. And am I gonna kill him though? Not sure, am I? He's down to 5 HP. What else is he getting? Just gateway and two gases. So it could be an expansion. Or it could be some oracles or something. We will see what it is. So it has this probe here, it's got 10 shields and 5 HP. Wow, it's regenerating so fast, already up to 20 shields. So he's gonna get out of there just in time and safely. Maybe I could have sniped it, pulled off two drones off the mirror line and took it out, maybe. Oh well. So yeah, he's gonna get a pylon over here and cyber core and pylon. And this, this is actually a strange wall. Not exactly quite sure why he's doing this over here. He should have done it over here in front of his natural, I would say. I mean, eventually you can get another war he wall here as Protoss, but I don't think you should do that in the early game. Again, I'm not the Protoss master, but still. And he's gonna go for Twilight Council. Okay, so that's why he does this, because he wants to hide the tech. But when a Zerg normally sees this, or even Protoss, I mean, not the browser. They normally think that something's gonna be up. Uh, I mean, why do you do this here? Why do you put those buildings here to wall off? I mean, something's going wrong. Normally you do it here. So, does that mean you're not gonna take your expansion? Probably means so, right? So, I do have both watchtowers or, or will do soon and I'm gonna take out this little probe chasing it with the link and of course I have this hatch over here I have the natural hatch here and the main hatch here trying to chase the probe not working out too well for me still don't have that link over here so the fact that he hasn't been aggressive yet is very good for me and since I haven't actually seen an expansion from him yet I don't see that there aren't any probes mining off of it or anything. Like I'm just think I'm just thinking at this point that uh, there has to be something, right? So I'm getting a lot of queens. I have one queen here, two queens here, the third base no queen. And uh, this overlord still. Uh... Oh, I forgot to toggle the timeline off, so you could actually see how long it takes. Sorry, sorry for the spoilers. Anyway, Twilight Council over here, getting a blink upgrade. So he's not going GTs actually, he's just gonna go blink stalkers. 
So if I hold this, it's a one base blink stalkers. It's gonna come out very late and I have three bases. I'm still getting lots of drones. But in fact, this is a mistake. I mean, I see no expansion. I'm still saturating my third. If it was like a six, uh, four gate attack, I would have been dead right now because I didn't have a roach warren ready. I didn't have. How many units do I have? Two zerglings and four queens. That's it. If it was a four gate, I think four gate hits at like 630. Maybe I'm wrong. But I would have been in so much trouble right now. I probably would have lost the game. But thankfully for me, it's not a four gate. I do see two stalkers over here. Where am I looking at? I finally see those two stalkers and now I'm looking at everywhere else and I'm trying to get upgrades and stuff. I'm gonna be making lots of roaches I think, but I am supply blocked, which is bad. Because I could have made a lot of roaches right now. Actually I still I got an overlord, so now I'm getting five roaches. And I see that he has a pylon over here and some stalkers. And these stalkers, man, they're gonna do like I have no roaches right now. I'm getting more roaches, which is good. And I, right now, it's all units for me. Nothing else. Just pure units. And I, I should be getting uh, uh, roach speed when that's done. I don't seem to. And I don't have this, though. And there he has it. Army supply. It's actually pretty equal. Now that I look at him. It, but I have much more worker supply and I should be should have made like a lot of and I still made drones. I still made drones Why did I make drones? Not so bad. He still has a second expansion, but I'm transfusing And I can't actually engage here He's actually doing some six link micro well for the most part You can blank that one away. This one should blank too. So yeah, at this point he's probably feeling, yeah, this game is done. I mean, it's natural to kill him with drones. But right now, just look at this. I have links, I have drones. Stalkers are actually not so good against drones. With link support as well, and his army supply is just falling down. Yes, I lost. I actually only lost four workers. That was very effective for me and now 23 army supply to his 12 he's on one base I have 53 worker supply and 24 for him like if I lose from here it's like what how did he lose this <laughs> also have hydralisks uh, going soon so he has more links here and I stop him with my links three roaches and he actually says die because his rush actually failed so yeah it looks like my zerg is pretty good so, thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.